Hey y'all, it's just me, Robin, and today I am participating in the Spring is in the Air Spring Tablescape Challenge, being hosted by Stephanie of Creatively Miss Me with Stephanie and Bridget of Bree's Project Book. The rules for this challenge were simple. We must include flowers. We must include the hashtag in the description, Spring Tablescape 2020. Mention both of their channels, Creatively Miss Me with Stephanie and Bree's Project Book. Uh, link, uh, put the link for both of their channels as well as the playlist in the description box. Subscribe to all of their channels and then just have some spring fun. So here's my spring is in the air, springtime lilac and green tablescape. As you can see, I used shades of purple, lavender, and lilac, as well as a very soft mint green. The centerpiece is flowers that I used in my Midsummer Night's Dream tablescape. I just added a few pieces of Dollar Tree uh, flowers. Um, I think they were lilacs and um, some orchids. The glasses, the glassware I got from the thrift store and the green goblets um, is a set of four that was all that I could find. And I've had these for a couple of years. And then the green, it's either called Indiana Glass White Hall. Um, it's got like a, square pattern in it. There's another, um, I think Bostoria made a, made some of it, and then there was another one. I don't know which one this is, but I got a whole set of them. Um, I think there's eight of the drink glasses, eight of the dessert glasses, and there's another one. I can't remember what it was, but I got all of them, and I think I may have may have paid maybe eight dollars for the whole set of like twenty four glasses. Then at the head of the table, I got these iridescent purple lavender wine glasses. There's uh, three of those. Um, no, I think four. I got those from the uh, th thrift store also, and I think they were a dollar ninety nine a piece. I've had them as well. I like pretty glasses, so whenever I see them at the thrift store, I pick them up. But I've had them for a while also, and like I said, I got these green uh, wine glasses also from the thrift store. I basically shopped my home for that stuff. Then I've got two bottles of sparkling rosé, uh, sparkling grape cider uh, from Welch's and they had pretty bottles. So I got one in uh, lilac and one in like a rose color. And then the green vase in the middle, I've had it for years. I think I got it with some flowers in it 
from a florist long time ago but it's like a crackle glass and I just kept it and it comes in handy then I got some Dollar Tree colored bottles and vases just for extra decoration then in the I got some lavender or lilac colored candle pedestals And they were an as-is purchase from QVC, and they were $19 for the set of three in graduated heights. Then I got a French lavender cal uh, can candle on both sides. And then a lavender cal candle on the smallest one. Then there's my friends, the little white birds, white and silver birds. Then the table, the dinnerware in each place setting is the same. Um, there's a pale green glass charger plate that I got from Hobby Lobby last year at the end of spring along with the pink ones that I showed in my previous tablescape. And again, I think it was either 50 or 60% off, um, off season. And then this year, the newest thing that I got is these um, melamine or melamine um, purple lavender plates. And I got them from Hobby Lobby and they were 40% off. They look like crackle glass, but they're actually melamine. And then these plates are from the Dollar Tree. And I've had them for a while. These are the little saucers. They get these every year. And then um, the uh, napkin rings I got from Home Goods a couple of years ago and then the napkins are new also and they are in the spring collection and they match the runner I just like the purple and the green or the lavender it's one of my favorite colors. And I think it looks so nice with the green. And then I got a piece of sheer fabric. Um, it's called Candy Grape. Um, and I got that from Hobby Lobby also and I just threw it over my table because my table is like a cherry wood and I wanted I didn't want to cover it up completely but I didn't want the red to show through so I got this piece of fabric and put it up under the runner but this is my tablescape and I think it says spring is definitely in the air. And if anybody knows what the actual name of these glasses are, with the, looks like checkerboard. No, square, I don't know what they are. But anyway, if it's Fostoria or if it's Indiana Whitehall or American Whitehall, um, it all looks the same to me. I'll show you the charger plates also. They're real light pale green. You can see it. Sorry, I'm going to blind you all. I watched them 
and of course they you know how they always have everything at 40 percent off before the season is over with but i did wait on those until they got to be it was either 50 or 60 percent so that's my spring is in the air tablescape springtime in lavender and green I'll also show you guys my bar area, my bar cart. I tried to make it a little springy also. I put the little bunnies in the middle. They're surrounded by some grass, a little succulents from Dollar Tree and some lavender candles and some more of the sparkling grape cider bottles. And then I have that, I found some purple chocolate kisses back in February. And I just put them in these little apothecary jars that I get from the thrift store couple of years ago so I didn't spend a lot I hope you guys like it please like share and subscribe to my channel go check out the playlist for the spring is in the air um, table skate challenge Stop by Stephanie's channel, Creatively Miss Me with Stephanie, and Bree's Project Book with Bree. Thank you, ladies, for hosting this collab. Hope to see you in many more. You guys be blessed, be safe. If you don't have to go out, don't. Take a walk outside, stay away from crowded areas. Wash your hands. Use common sense. I love you guys. Y'all take care. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.